Okay, we have opened UVision Landscape Creator. I'm going into Tools, Terrain Elevation Import Wizard. Property I surveyed was Matt. We need the CSV file. Here's all our data. We can take a look at that. From this point forward, you just hit the defaults. Next. Once again, you can take a look at this. Just hit the defaults and finish. 10 points. And there's our plot. Pretty simple. Easy peasy. I'm going to rotate this just a little bit to line it up. That's the way the house was laying. Now, you can design from this, but we also have the feature in uh, UVision to import and overlay a photo. And if you've got a drone image, it's really cool. We go into the uh, picture import wizard. You want to select the overlay function. And I've got the JPEG here. Now we'll lay this over the top. It can be, this is lined up very well, surprisingly enough. It can be uh, upside down, sideways. You usually have to rotate it quite a bit. We're gonna have to make it considerably larger. But as you can see, I made it a little too big there. It takes a little while to zero this in exactly where you want it. I'm not gonna make you bear with me the entire time. I also got the angle here where you rotate it around a little bit to line it up. We're still just a little bit small, I think. Let me go this way now. We gotta shrink it down just a little bit to fit in You can see how we line this up, and I've got the finished image. It's a little better if you rotate, if you make it larger. So we're getting pretty close there, but you see, you see how that goes. From this point forward, you got all the information in as far as ground measurements. You go to do whatever design work you need. Uh, you can tell exactly the you know we we started with a zero point here. We go up to uh, almost four feet, three foot, 11 inches higher over here, drops back down over here. You can see the contour lines, what have you. It's pretty, pretty straightforward process once you walk through it a time or two.